Welcome back to Project 613. Today we learn two mitzvot. Number one, the prohibition against taking collateral for a loan from a widow. So if one lends money to a widow, and it's a mitzvah to lend money to anyone, especially to a widow, it is forbidden to take anything from her as security against the loan, even though this is common practice that when we lend money to someone, we want to take a guarantee that the loan will be repaid. But in the event that this is a loan being made to a widow, the Torah says this is forbidden. As the verse clearly says, Do not take the clothing of the widow as a guarantee against the loan. And the Torah is very clear that there is no difference whether the widow is rich or poor. The Torah only stipulates that if it's a widow, this is forbidden. And there is a double reason for this mitzvah. Number one, this is the Torah's kindness toward the widow, that after, after what she's been through, where she's lost her husband, and she has that sadness from having to live on her own without her husband, the Torah doesn't want to put her under an additional stress and an additional strain of having to worry what will happen if she isn't able to repay her loan, will she also lose this item? And therefore the Torah says it's forbidden to take away this item from her, so she should not have to have that additional worry about not getting that back. That's one reason. And the second reason is for the person himself, that the person doing the mitzvah, to make that person more compassionate, to implant within the person who gave the loan the attribute of mercy. And this is one of the general things that the Torah, one of the general agendas that the Torah has with all of the mitzvah, to make us into better people, to make us into more kind and more compassionate people. And this is indeed one of the reasons for this mitzvah as well, to help the person doing the mitzvah himself become more compassionate. By not taking the guarantee for the loan from this widow, this helps the person develop within himself an extra sense of kindness and an extra sense of compassion. That's the first mitzvah that we learned today. The second mitzvah is also about taking guarantees for a loan, and that is any time a guarantee is taken for a loan, it's forbidden to take items that are used in food preparation. So for example, any items that are used for grinding, for kneading, for cooking, slaughtering animals, or any other type of food preparation, it is forbidden to take these items as a security against a loan. The Torah says that this is considered like taking the person's life if one takes these items that are needed for the person to prepare their meals. Um, in the event that a person transgresses this prohibition and does take these items, the Jewish court, the Bet Din, would seize them from the person, would take them and return them to the one who borrowed the money and give them back to them. Have a wonderful, wonderful day. <laughs>